Hi, my name is Sam Biddle and in this lesson from Be Creative in Sam Biddle's free classroom, you actually have four different examples and we're going to start off with the Christmas design because of course it's not long now. I thought I would show you something absolutely amazing that you can do with the pigments and the nail art pen. I want to see your results everybody. Please make sure that you post your results on the Facebook page. I hope you enjoy this lesson and I look forward to hearing from you soon on social media. Bye! So we are going to use pigments. So all you'll need is four tips, two painted with gel polish in white and two in black. Very, very simple because it's the pigments that's going to give us all the colour we need. So like I said before, we're going to start off with this Christmas design and we're going to do holly. Holly or green, I'm going to apply green pigment. Logical, right? So we're just going to go with that whole Christmas feel and vibe. So I've got basilisk bronze from the Chameleon collection and I've got cut grass from the Brights collection. That's going to give us our green and our bronzy colours. And then we're going to add some more gecko green from the Chameleon collection and that's what we're putting on here and then of course a little bit of glitter uh, from the party collection because well it's christmas right now this is where the magic comes in we are pressing in the pigment into that inhibition layer okay i've shown you how to do this so many times in each of the lessons we're layering it up. You can see I'm adding just a little bit more of the pigment just to get that intense color. Now, the nail art pen is not just for painting. I think it is perfect to scratch out the pigment. And what happens is it gathers up the pigment underneath that nib and you get this beautiful crisp line. You, of course, could paint this, but guys, girls, if you are struggling to get fine lines or if you just don't have the time to do a whole bunch of nail art in the salon, this is perfect because all you're going to do is apply your pigment and then scratch it back out in your design. Yes, you've guessed it. For the next three nails, I am going to show you different techniques. No, I'm not. I'm going to show you different designs using this technique, just scratching it out. Now I'm not Superwoman, I have sped up this film right now, so don't panic, <laughs> you don't have to go this fast. But I just wanna show you now what this nail could potentially look like. A little bit more glitter. This glitter is from the Serenity Collection. This is a beautiful, beautiful gold. And I'm just adding this on the inhibition layer that I didn't quite catch with my pigment colors. Now I'm using the nail art pen as a dotting tool. If you don't have the nail art pen, with this technique you could always use a dotting tool. But you will find that you will get it will gather little balls of pigment on the end of that dotting tool and then you'll end up having sort of little uh, balls of pigment that you have to brush away. So the nail art pen is much, much better to use with this. A small amount of white to highlight those berries and that is it my friends. All you need to do then is top coat. I promised you it was a quick design. Now, if I was going to do this on a client, I wouldn't do every single nail with three or four different holly. I would perhaps just do a couple of hollies and some berries in the top right hand corner of one nail and maybe some on the free edge of another. But this is a great example of what you can do. Second nail. This is what we're going to do next. We're going to do butterflies, exactly the same as what we did before. I polished the nail with gel and cured it. And then I'm pressing in that inhibition layer, a beautiful ombre of purple. I'm using a range of purples from the Pretty Collection, the Brights Collection and the Chameleon Collection. I have sped this up. Okay, this is not me working. I am uh, pretty fast, but I'm not that fast. And now all I'm going to do is scratch out with the nail art pen and I'm scratching out butterflies. You can do flowers, you can do 
all sorts of different effects. If you wanted to do a Halloween design and scratch out some um, old uh, scary castles or bats, that's of course brilliant, it's a perfect uh, look. Christmas, you can scratch out Christmas trees, presents, all sorts of different things. There are so many different options. The only limitation is, of course, your imagination. <laughs> I am going to stop talking right now and I'm going to let you enjoy this film. There are two more designs coming up and then I'll catch you uh, right at the end just to explain a couple of other little things.
I loved, love, love doing that rose. Could you see how I created the ombre in a different way, not top to bottom? We started with the darker center and we worked out to the light. Those I use the Serenity Collection with. Oh my goodness, isn't it a beautiful, beautiful design? So I want to see your works of art using the pigments and seeing what you come up to. The best way to do it is to press those pigments in. Do not rub them and you are going to get some amazing results. Thank mm -hmm. you.